Hi, Leos. So this is going to be your February reading. I hope you guys enjoy. Thank you guys so much for all the love and support. If this does resonate, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, letting me know that it does resonate. I am open for personal readings now, so if you guys do want to book a reading with your girl, um, lizzytarot1010 at gmail.com. Um, my candle work is still going. I do have a couple spots open. I do love money, open road, better business. Um, I do reversals. I do take off black magic. Let me know what you need and I got it. My $5 cash app questions are still going. Those are strictly um, through email, but my readings are over the phone. So let's get into the reading. I did pre-shuffle. I am using the Broken Mirror Oracle deck. Um, shout out to Jamie. Her YouTube is Jamie Zebra 23 um, I <laughs> This deck is the literal best. I was so excited. She gifted it to me. So um, thank you so much. Um, and yeah, so let's get into the reading. So we did get dating. So I did like pre-shuffle off the camera just to make the reading kind of go a little bit quicker. So we did get dating. So I feel like you're back on the market. Um, you have new love. I feel like old love, you're just like, it's a no. You don't want anyone from your past for sure. I feel like you're being in your hopeless romantic energy right now. You really want someone new, fresh, that makes you feel excited, um, that you want to go on dates with. You want to get ready. You want to go out. You want to laugh. You want to do this. You want to do that, right? But I feel like someone from the past that, you know, you guys could have been together. I feel like they were hiding their feelings from you. You know, even though they're detached and cold, giving you the cold shoulder. I feel like they're strict, like they're actually secretly in love with you. Like dead ass. I feel like they have deep emotions and they're going to see that you're dating and they're going to be pissed. They might want to do like something to break you guys up. But I feel like this person's a hater. Maybe it's your friends that are even haters because I feel like. They're trying to be like, yeah, well, you know, be careful with them because, you know, since they look good, they might cheat on you and all this weird shit. Right. And I feel like they are trying to tell you like, yeah, well, you know, um, I'm doing this with so and so or whatever, trying to like, like throw it in your face or try to make you feel a type of way. But in reality, it backfired. Now they're ashamed. Now they're embarrassed. Um, they it like backfired on them. Like whatever they were trying to do, whatever this hater was trying to do or whatever this ex lover was trying to do, um, literally it backfired. <laughs> and I feel like you saw the red flags. Maybe this person was like unfaithful. Maybe this person was a cheater. And I feel like um, you trusted your intuition for sure. You trusted your dreams. Maybe you were having dreams that this person was cheating on you. You were trusting your guidance and this guidance led to you to let go of this person. Cause you're like, obviously this person doesn't love me enough to tell me how they feel. Right. Um, if, a, if a person's not telling you how they feel, maybe they have someone else. There could be so much, maybe people are shy and I get that cause I'm very shy myself, but there comes a point where you just have to Put your big girl pants on or your big boy pants on and just tell them how you feel, right? But I feel like whoever this is, someone is for sure stalking you, like heavy, heavy stalking you, going to tarot readers to see what you're doing, if you're dating, and they're telling them, hell yeah, they are, hell yeah, they are, and they're sick and tired of your bullshit. <laughs> they're over the cycle, they're over, they're drained, their decision is made. You should have told them how you felt a long time ago a long time ago <laughs> let's see yeah and they feel guilty as fuck they feel ashamed remorseful they want to come back with an apology telling you baby let's make it work and you're just like no i'm having fun in my my own circle and look at this shit <laughs> they are literally trying to avoid the situation, maybe whatever they got caught on or whatever backfired on them. Um, maybe they always felt like you were going to be there. There was no communication and they're just probably going to pop up like nothing like, oh, hey, how are you? You're just like, what the hell? Who is this? Who is this? <laughs> even though you know who it is, but you're just like, what the hell? And they could even be looking at your pictures in regret reminiscing about the times you guys had together missing you deeply like to the point where they're like i don't even know if i can get them back right and i feel like they think that you guys can 
Like, you can forgive and forget, but you can't. You can't. You're just like, no, I, I don't want to, right? But I feel like you have a lot of attraction right now, Leo. You're attracting new and better people. People are infatuated by you as well. I feel like people are obsessed with you. Um, you just have this glow to you. <laughs> you just have this glow to you. And this ex-person is just trying to see how to mess it up. But don't let them. Yeah, because I feel like they're hiding. They're like thinking you're being mysterious, secretive, sneaky. Like, oh, they're going out with them at night or they're not going out in our city because they don't want me to run into them. Like just weird shit like that. Let's see what else. If you guys do want to book a reading with me, Lizzie Tarot 1010, any services, um, just email me and I will get back to you for sure. And my $5 cash up questions are still going so I feel like this person had a double life, though, when they were dealing with you. They would act like a good person, but behind your back, they were, like, talking to other people or telling the other people the same thing. They were just a liar. I feel like they had multiple people, and they thought they were never going to get caught, and they did. So that's all I have for you, Leo. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, if you guys have any questions about my services or want to book a reading with me, email me, and I will get back to you, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care.